Bloodsworth has a big update on some tropical stuff happening that we need to keep an eye on it. Yeah, yeah, breaking news out of the southwestern Caribbean. The area that we've been monitoring last couple of days is now Tropical Depression 16. We'll zoom in a little bit closer. Get your bearings straight. Here's Costa Rica, Central America. There's Nicaragua. And this is the depression. Winds now 35 miles per hour. And the movement is northwest at 7. So it's actually drawing closer to the Nicaraguan coastline. Here's the forecast track from the National Hurricane Center. This just came out a few minutes ago. It is expected to become a named storm. It would be Tropical Storm Nate. In fact, we've already got Tropical Storm warnings issued for portions of Honduras and Nicaragua. This is Friday morning, about two days from now. Then it starts rolling through the warm waters, and then it enters the, the Gulf of Mexico, uh, the southern Gulf of Mexico, by Saturday. Now, once it gets to this point, there is a lot of uncertainty as to exactly where this will go. And you look at the current track, still pay attention to the entire cone of uncertainty. It is expected to become a category one hurricane at this point tampa bay is outside of the cone but right now we're looking at an area from mississippi all the way back through the florida panhandle and florida's big bend then it weakens as it rolls into the southeast here are two of the forecast models that we look at often the american gfs and the european model both of them in fairly good agreement as we head in towards Nicaragua and also towards uh, Honduras. Then we get into the southern Gulf of Mexico. Then notice the spread in the forecast models. Once we get beyond this point, the uncertainty widens. You look at the GFS, this actually takes it towards Louisiana. The European model takes us back towards Florida's Big Bend. That's why you notice that cone is fairly wide once we get towards Sunday. So the impacts would be middle of the day on Sunday as a potential impact to the northern Gulf Coast. But at this point, northern Gulf Coast all the way towards the west coast of Florida needs to monitor uh, this developing situation.